bit of clipping there. Because right. we're starting off from nothing, so we'll put diff locks on. Yeah, you don't have to stick to roads, you can go wherever the hell you want in this game. But sometimes, you know, that call might work well. It's so cool that you can set a fuel through the. Yeah, I've been wanting this game for ages, uh, and it finally came on sale. We get deals with gold, you know, so it was like thirty percent off. So I thought, I'd grab it. That's what it is at, at sixty bucks Australian. Like that was still pretty expensive for what the game actually is. Right, might check the difference on it because it's a bit slow. Does look pretty fucked. Let's go. Yeehaw. Now on the PC, I know that you can get mods for this. I'm not sure about the Xbox. I haven't heard anything about the Xbox. Um, and uh, then again, I didn't look at the menu. So, Ooh. Ooh. hit a tree. Now some trees you can knock over, and if your vehicle's big enough, right. I'm sneaking suspicion that mine's probably not big enough. Alright, here goes the river crossing, so definitely need to diff locks on. Oh, this looks like it's going quick. Oh, this is sketchy. Don't want to stop now. Right, balls deep. Let's go. Keep going. 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 Ah, Jesus! I'm surprised that little garage cart doesn't get knocked away. There we go, we made it. A bit deeper than I thought it was. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have to go up this road here to get to the fuel station. There's a lot more detail in this too than I expected there to be. This game is all about picking your driving lines like I should be watching the drive line a bit more. Jeez, it's amazing how much that mud just makes you stop. You just stop dead. Alright, let's check the map. Yep, yep, keep heading down here. Keep heading down here. Oh no, this looks dodgy ass. Oh, just stopped dead. That is shit. Alright, let's see. Can I break out the winch? Winch connected. Alright, we're winching through the forest. Alright, advanced options. Release the winch. Good 
to it. Now we get to winch two. I want to get to that tree that's right in front of me. Oh, 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 bad choice. Bad choices. Just keep going. Alright, alright. <laughs> That's a very elastic fucking tree there. See, in your multiplayer, like, you can winch off each other. You know, you can get two trucks to winch and pull each other through. Like, this is actually pretty tame stuff compared to some of the full game that you know, is further into the game that I know it exists. There is some tough tracks. And especially some of the mods that you can get for this game. Man, they build some tracks. Some of them are just beyond ridiculous. Come on. Alright, I should be able to winch. I want to winch up that thicker tree up. No, 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 no. We want to winch off that tree there. Just yeah, that, that tree I think will be too bendy. Okay, okay, okay. And then we disconnect. We'll keep going. You know, I, I could just drive around forever exploring this world. To me, this is what a driving game should be. This isn't a racing game, it's a driving game. Alright. And... Okay, we are a lot heavier now, but we have a full load of fuel, and we can refuel ourselves. So I think what I'll do is I'll head, oh there's more things up there to unlock, I'll head here, into here, into here, and across. And then we want to head to wherever there is. All wheel drive, let's go. If lots would know all wheel drive, I don't think the, the truck would cope too well. Because if you go into advance, you can refuel with the system. You see, you can detach the trailer at any time. Little jeep you usually for use for exploring, but that's boring. Let's use the big truck. It's when you're on a, a surface that's uh, not soft and squishy, you actually can get some speed up. Speed going. Cruise. And then you hit a bog hole and you just fall into it. Like I didn't take a detour through there. This little trailer's cool. Alright, we're taking a detour. We're going off roading. Sometimes you hit water pools that actually have a solid base. 
so you can actually just drive through them pretty well. At other times you hit ones that don't. This one's okay. Um, we're actually trudging through this alright. As you get stuck. No, 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 we're good, we're good. Just get to the edge, just get a little bit of grip. There we go. Look at the way the water cleans the wheels off though. Actually being heavier will probably help about a bit more in some some bits. Because this game's physics and are, are just nuts, man. Actually, this actually doesn't look that bad. We might be able to get some speed up. As, yeah. I'm going no miles an hour. I'll try with the diff locks off. We might save a little bit of fuel. Solid ground. Brief period. You can sort of tell where the boggy spots are, but sometimes it's just. Okay, well, the road has. Uh, disappeared. So now we're just out in the wilderness. I don't want to go through the water because I've got no diff locks on. So there's our... Oh, I think I got too close to the edge there. I'm just going to whack the diff locks on. you got to watch those rocks. Because if you hit those rocks too hard with your under underside, Jesus, this is so squishy. Holy fuck. Try closer to the watch point. Hey. And then we made it. So that revealed that chunk of the map. So... I might try, so I'm going to call the, the video there, but next episode we'll try and get to that corner, that fuel station and that garage, because we've got one garage point, um, that was my luck, there's probably a straight road that just goes across the back of the map, but hey, that's, that's not fun, we'll try and get to that garage and then we'll, we'll trudge along to the uh, log station over there. To unlock those other two vehicles and we'll go from there thanks for watching guys see you in the next one